Hey guys, it's Nikki. I want to do another unboxing videos because I did those in the past and those seem kind of fun. Recently, I've been gifted a subscription box. Thank you. Hopefully, my address doesn't show up anywhere. Scosh box. And the scariest thing, it says, um, like, it has an agriculture protection sticker, so slightly spooky. But I assume it's food. There's actually like a sticker and like a custom sticker for like it passed Japan, so I guess it's like from Japan. Oh, okay. Okay. So weird, it seems like somebody went shopping and then they're like, all right, I'm just gonna put this in. Oh, okay. So you can like hashtag and win some stuff. And actually, this doesn't tell you anything, so this is fine. So there's nothing spicy because I will die. Oh, look at this cute little dude. I guess I'll keep this bag. Oh, and then on the back it says Tokyo Otaku Mode. So the first item, Ariel. Um, there's a piece of corn on it, so I assume it's like a corn chip. Weird shapes, they look like that cereal. It smells sweet. That's a good snack. I like this, this is delicious. <laughs> I have zero idea what this is. Nothing. This does not tell me anything. It's like a like a little cutlet, <laughs> like a steep, like deep fried like cake. <laughs> they look like tiny chicken nuggets. Also have water ready just in case. Yeah, it feels like a very dry <laughs> chicken nugget. Oh, this looks fun. Like a coffee or like a latte based thing. It seems like a cookie. Ooh. Look at this. Mm. It has like a slightly weird, like bitterish aftertaste. Like matcha ish. And like, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of like matcha stuff. Oh, it's in my mouth. Ugh, I still taste it. <laughs> All right. Um, it just gets more and more confusing the deeper in the bag I go, but. What? They feel squishy though. This does not feel edible and there's supposed to be something inside. It's kind of like... Okay, so I don't know what the center is, but it tastes very familiar. It's definitely a marshmallow. It's a marshmallow with something on the inside, but I don't know what the inside is. This doesn't end. Oh, okay, we got a square. Okay, these, these I like. So we had something called Choco Boys, I think, where it was like literally like just like a mushroom, like it was candy mushrooms. So like it's like a, I know what this is. This I had before. Finally, I know something that I'm about to consume. The green, I'm not too fond of. <laughs> not too fond of, it, but it smells nice. Yeah, I mostly taste the strawberry and the white chocolate. Oh, this looks fancy. Look at that. English chocolate cookies made with the finest ingredients. So I guess this is just a chocolate cookie thingy They're so tiny and they're so flat too, but so let's try this mm -hmm. It's good. Yeah, it's a white chocolate like cookie Vanilla -ish coconut aftertaste, so it's it's quite nice and tinkly in my mouth it's Good is this like a this looks like a high chew, so I assume this is like a similar high chew-ish esque product. Alright, let's try this. It does not smell like anything though. Very, very light pear flavor. Or slightly hint of apple-ish, because I don't think pear has like that distinguish of a taste. This is a smoothie gummy, but this is actually a good combination because I can imagine having like kale broccoli and something like this as a gummy because that sounds disgusting. This actually sounds like a good combination that like would be fun to eat. It feels like a, I feel like so healthy trying to eat this. Look at these th This looks like a carrot. Oh, and it definitely smells like mango carrot-ish. Don't smell banana. Okay, that's... <laughs> I say it's a very unique taste, solidified the smoothie a little bit. I taste mostly carrot, 
and like an aftertaste of mango. We have one last item, and I think this is like a. It's like this looks like a cute little sticky note. So I guess it's like the little gift that comes with it. That's a cute little stationery, good for letters. I would say I'm pretty happy with all of them. I, I do like the chips a lot. They're very fun to eat, and also I just like chips in general. Chips are like my favorite snack. I do like this, and <laughs> of course I would like my mushroom boys. This I like the the outer part i just want to know what's the inside part <laughs> i think the least favorite is is this just because it has a matcha aftertaste and yeah hope you guys enjoyed testing out these snacks and i guess if you want to try one for yourself you can check out tokyo taco mode and check their snack box all right thank you guys for watching and be sure to check out my other videos and also follow me on social media and all these other things are in the description and maybe somewhere on the side so um, thank you and i'll see you guys later bye I got my grandma here. Okay, what's it? Who's this? I'm going to print it. Oh, for the plastilin. Yeah. Mmm. It's like a little bit of a little bit of a little bit. What? No, it's also soft. Yeah. And it's also delicious. I liked it. I don't know. Ну это тоже, наверное, какое-то печенье, но что-то там но внутри, такой... что-то рыбное. Да, мне кажется. кажется, вот что-то вот либо рыбное, либо мясное. Нет, мне кажется, что-то рыбное. Я банан вообще не чувствую. Я чувствую да. морковь. И потом, Нет, может мор... быть, немножко а манго. Морковь, я... вот, может быть, манго и банан. Да? Морковь я не чувствую. А я, у меня на да. Мне кажется, что здесь кокос. Да. Но мне сначала показывалось, но потом у меня просто mm -hmm. привкус матча был mm -hmm. после этого, да? А матч это что? Рейтинг. Вкусно, интересно. Вкусно, интересно. Я обычно попробовала и... рамен, теперь да. можно попробовать. И вот, и вот это вот мне больше, больше всего. Больше всего, да, мне да. тоже больше всего понравилось. Мне это очень нравится. Да, мне тоже.